good this morning. I love a good routine. I love when I'm back in that mode. I'm in a very pink mood lately, but I feel like everything on me lately is pink. I don't know if that's because like I'm entering like my follicular phase and I feel super feminine and just, I don't know. I'm just in a good, good mood today. First of all, y'all, we hit 100,000 subscribers on YouTube. That's insane to me. Like, I remember being in my old apartment, writing in my five minute journal, like I'm grateful that I have 100,000 subscribers. And I kind of gave up on that dream because I'm like, YouTube's one of the hardest platforms to grow. Like people gotta really mess with you to really like subscribe and have you on their feed and for them to sit down and watch long form content. I feel like the whole world shifted to short term content. And you know, that's where I found my success is on TikTok and like Instagram reels. So it means a lot to me that I was able to be consistent. I was able to offer you quality. I was able to prove to myself that literally I just put it out into the universe what I want and I take aligned action to get there and I'm soft with myself and I'm gentle with myself and I'm not afraid to learn and be a student. Hopefully y'all have seen like the upgrade and the quality of my videos and I'm gonna continue to learn. So I say that all to say is like, Oh, I just I'm very very I'm very proud of myself you know and I'm, I'm excited to get 200,000 and 300,000 and I'm excited for just like this community of women for the girls to just pour into themselves someone left the sweetest comment the other day and under like my life how I changed my life video and they said like I feel like this is what you were called to do you were called to help women pour into themselves you were called to help women prioritize their self-care like I really feel like that's what you were meant to do and that makes me so happy because it make, make me feel so seen I'm like yes that is what I'm supposed to do like I went through my own things in my own life that were traumatic that were heartbreaking just so that I could come out on the other side of it and I could learn the tools necessary to teach you and to show you that self-care and prioritizing yourself will bring you everything that you want in this life. I'm very happy thank you so much I need to think I need to like figure out what I'm gonna do for 100k my default is just to do gift cards. Um, I kind of want to make it like a little bit more personable. So if you have any ideas, let me know. But today, honestly, hitting that 100K, I really want this Globe Diaries to be about productivity. How to be productive, but also be soft and prioritize your self-care at the same time. Like, how do you balance the two? Because I feel like I reached 100K, but I didn't stress myself out. Like, YouTube has not stressed me out, to be honest with you. Um, and I feel like I've maintained that softness. So I'm excited to include like little tips and tricks in this specific glow up diaries about how to be productive but still live that soft girl life still live a slow life while still getting everything that you want i'm very excited for today we also have a sponsor for today which i'm very excited about because my friends use them so it's like when my friends use them and then i get a sponsorship from them i know it's good um but it is from blue land thank you so much blue land for sponsoring this video very excited to talk about them I've been using Blue Lynn for the past couple weeks, to be honest with you. Right now, I am about to go do some much needed grocery shopping, and I'm going to get some breakfast at Kill Me Crazy, and then I'm gonna come home and do a little reset. I, I really wanna clean space before I really delve into work. That's how I work best. So I'm excited to show you the Blue Lynn products and how they've been helping me maintain that mental clarity, that environmental clarity of my space. So very excited, very excited that you're here. If you you are new here hi my name is Jasmine I create a lot of content on how to glow up how to become your best self so if that sounds like something that you're really focusing in on you're really focusing on yourself in this year go ahead and hit the subscribe button like this video for more glove diaries these are some of my favorite videos to film and go ahead comment something down below a tip or a trick that you learned from this video I want you to know all about it I love when we chit chat in the comments so I will continue about my day I will check back in with you when we're resetting at home but thank you so much for watching this video and I'll talk to you later bye
where I really wanted this year to be about convenience. I wanted it to be about softness. Also wanted to be a little bit more conscientious about how I was impacting the planet. And I really just wanted to live a cleaner and greener lifestyle. So that's why I'm so excited that I discovered Blue Lynn. This video is sponsored by Blue Lynn. Thank you so much, Blue Lynn, for sponsoring this video and supporting this community. So Blue Lynn really focuses on reducing plastic use through cleaning products. These are eco-friendly refillable cleaners, all naturally derived and clean ingredients. Not only are their tablets just super effective, but knowing that I'm reducing my impact on this earth just makes me feel so good. It just makes me feel like that girl. I personally really like their sprays. I have the bathroom one, I have the multi-surface one, and I have the glass one, which is perfect for my apartment. I really like the Blue Land dishwasher tablet scent. So those are the two that I would recommend to you. And plus, Blue Land is giving our community 15% off your order. I'll have the QR code right here so you can just go ahead, scan it with your phone, or I'll have the link down in my description for you to get 15% off your first order of Blue Land. Let's get to cleaning. <laughs> Shave cream. They were all out of my um, I have it in my shower right now. My Flamingo shave cream. They were all out of that. Um, I don't know. Let's try it. I restocked on my Black Girl Sunscreen SPF 30. I do like the kids SPF 50, even though it's higher SPF, but this has Jehovah and avocado and it's so moisturizing. Oh my gosh. Uh, I restocked on my Love Wellness pH Balancing Cleanser. This is my favorite feminine wash ever. You know, feminine products. I really like these. These are the L brand 100% organic cotton tampon. And this is new. All of those are pretty like restocked. This is new. This is the Saltaire and Santal Bloom. I couldn't smell it in Target. So this will be our first time like really smelling it. I love the bottle. Oh, okay. I'm gonna wear this today. It's definitely giving winter. It's definitely giving winter to me. products I just use them first of all the salt hair oh, it's giving such grown woman and it pairs so well with this EOS vanilla cashmere I'm about to put on vanilla woods by the seven virtues and my Donna Karen uh, deodorant I feel like I'm gonna smell so grown like sexy like that's how I describe that scent is sexy the EOS shave cream came right back out of my shower I will not be using that. Here's the good parts about it. It was really moisturizing and I loved the scent. I love all EOS products. I don't know if I'm just a shaving foam type of girl, but it was so creamy that it barely protected my skin from the razor. I'd be very interested to see the reviews on that because that's not my thing, child. Also, this robe is new. It is from Pottery Barn. 
I went on TikTok and I typed in luxury bathrobe. I'm like, you know what? I love self-care so much. Let me treat myself to like a very nice bathrobe. And they recommended this one from Pottery, Pottery Barn and I could engrave it with my initial and I could design the engraving for like $15 more. It's so nice because it's a waffle, but it's also a spa. So it's like light, but it's cozy and it has pockets. I'm obsessed with this robe. Right now, what we need to do is I'm probably gonna grab a little snack and quickly film the last product shots of this brand campaign I'm working on for TikTok. And then I need to film, edit, voice record that all over. That's gonna take me like an hour. And then I need to edit, co-pilot, and then I need to post my YouTube video finally. I have some work to do, okay? So let's get to it. unwind for the day even though I still low-key have more work to do I wanted to talk about two things while I'm doing my skincare routine with you one a little update it was just me and my boyfriend's one year anniversary he had the entire weekend planned we went to like a Michelin star restaurant um, he had a surprise appointment at Van Cleef. He said, get what you want, and I got what I wanted. Um, and he was just so sweet all weekend. He actually ended up staying for like 10 days here in Atlanta. If you don't know, me and my boyfriend, um, we're long distance. Um, and it's worked so well for us. It's nice building intentional time with each other every single night, but then also having intentional time with like, our trips or what I like we were looking at like all of our pictures from the past year and it doesn't even seem like like we are long distance because of like intentionality that was really really fun again we hit 100k on YouTube like that is that warms my heart I signed some of my biggest brand deals to date things have just been really really good all around one thing and i think i mentioned to you before one thing that i feel like i'm kind of lacking but not lacking i feel like i have like a i have a best friend jordan right i have a best friend jordan i wish i could like replicate her i wish i could like replicate her into like two or three other people like sometimes i feel like i know a lot of people and a lot of people know me but it can be very surface level and i'm like is that a me problem or is that them like they don't take the time to get to know me or am i not taking the time to get to know them i don't know i just want i want to nurture more female friendships this year it's really been like top of mind but also nurturing friendships that 
you know, I feel like I pour a lot into people. And when you talk to me, I'm very engaged and in that moment. Um, and could I always be a better friend? Yes, but I don't know. It's just, it's so hard to make friends as an adult. But I'm going to be more intentional about it. And like I say, like, if you want something, put it out into the universe. Like, I want more genuine female friendships. And then I just need to take aligned action to do that. I need to start inviting more people out. I need to start putting myself out there, making myself feel uncomfortable. Stop waiting for it to come to me. Just need to like take my own advice. <laughs> Other updates that I have is I'm in the thick of planning my birthday trip. I'm going to Tulum for my birthday and I'm very, very excited. I'm in the thick of it only because so I've been to Tulum before. I fell in love with it. I had such a good time in Tulum. I was like, I'm coming back here with my boyfriend for my birthday. Like that's the end of it. I'm coming back here. So I went ahead and I booked an Airbnb and the Airbnb was cheap AF. I was like, boom, great. But then I started to think about it. And when I went to Tulum, I went with a really big girl friend group. And, you know, because it was so big, it was easier to split things. So we had like a private transfer for the full weekend that we were there. And, I, and then we had like a private chef, which they aren't that expensive out there. But I say that all to say is this will be my 27th birthday. I'm really excited. And I feel like because I've manifested this is the year of convenience. I feel like I'm so close to just paying for a hotel. Now, mind you, the hotel that I wanna stay in is a luxury hotel that is literally probably three times as much as the Airbnb. But it's more convenient. It's on the hotel strip near everything. They can organize the airport transfer and the different transportations in between all of the popular places. And part of me was like, Jasmine, why can't you get a hotel brand deal? So I tried to reach out to a couple of the big hotels. They all said that they weren't doing collaborations. They always do collaborations. It was just a no to me, which is like fine, whatever. I don't mind paying. I don't know. I don't know. What do you guys think? You think I should just get the hotel? I think I should just get the hotel. I want to relax. I want to go on a spa trip. I want to do a little party at Taboo and stuff like that. But I really just want to be in my era of convenience. I want to wake up. I don't want to be trying to figure out where to get groceries and transportation and calling this taxi and this and this and this and communicating with the Airbnb host. Like that is probably the last thing that I want to be doing on my birthday. That's also top of mind. I also have some very exciting trips planned for this year. DC, Houston, LA. I haven't decided what like international trip I want to do for the summer yet. Maybe Colombia, because I love Colombia and I really need to get my teeth deep cleaned over there. We are about to go sit down in my little quiet corner, decompress and do our red light and we'll talk a little bit there. It is about 11 o'clock at night. Just got off the phone with my boyfriend. I had a little bit of ice cream to end the night. Girl, I'm still editing. I'm still editing. I really need to get this brand campaign out. It was literally due on Monday. So whatever, we move. And I have an entirely separate other YouTube video that needs to be edited tomorrow. So this cannot drag into tomorrow. So right now, I think I can get this done by midnight. But just reflecting on the day i'm about to do my five minute journal can't read tonight unfortunately that's just what it is like i'm just gonna have to um keep editing but um but that's okay i love editing i love what i do i love that i get to sit here and while it is 11 o'clock at night and i do kind of want to go to bed i know that this content is valuable for you so why would i not stay up all night trying to make it the best for you 
So I'm not complaining um, as long as I get my journaling in and um, maybe in place of reading my book, I will do a little like sleep meditation with Headspace tonight. That always knocks me right out. So yeah, really hope you enjoyed this Glow Up Diaries. Again, thank you so much Blueland for sponsoring this video. They are literally amazing. Whenever the past couple of weeks, ever since I've been using Blueland, I just feel so much better. Like you're already spending money on cleaning supplies. Might as well take care of the earth at the same time and leave less of an impact. Best part is, is I have a discount for you right down in the description if you click that link. I love when sponsorships like this are so aligned with me my audience, things that y'all would actually be interested in. And I get to give you like a discount and I get to save you a little bit of coin on the way. Like I can't want for anything else. So thank you so much Blue Lynn for sponsoring this video. Click the link down below to support this channel. Get you some good quality cleaning products without harming the world that we live in. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you like this video that I'm editing for you. I hope you like this video right here. I will see you in another Glow Up Diaries. I will see you in another video. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram, on TikTok. You're going to find a lot of Glow Up content that you won't find on here. Thank you so much for 100K, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye, y'all.